So here we, we reset the button, reset button, open intelligence, open intelligence, open intelligence, immediate benefit, fun, the ultimate fun. And so resetting, resetting entire system, resetting the entire universe and all worlds to open intelligence in an instant, short moment. Short moment is all there is. There's one short moment at a time, just right here. So you hear short moments of open intelligence repeated many times until it becomes obvious. So that's one of the four mainstays, <coughs> the empowerment support um, structure. And one of them is the short moments and you hear it and it's the reset button. And it was quite amazing this morning to reset, to press that reset button, right? Reset and mind completely clear, wide open, not, not getting rid of thoughts and emotions. You might just think, okay, what is for lunch? How, um, oh, that one over there looks really good. And um, then mind completely vast and clear, open intelligence is built in, into every moment, into every already built in, you don't have to build it in, you don't have to get it, we're not having packages of open intelligence to take with you. It's like built into every single particle of your being and everything all at once. And when we say data, it's all the thoughts and emotions and experiences, everything we can perceive, we call data. So open intelligence and data are inseparable. Mind, open intelligence, data, a vast expanse, inseparable, like the color blue in the sky, inseparable. And to recognize our nature, reset button, open intelligence, open intelligence, immediate benefit. It's reset button, recognizing who we truly are and claiming that power. Be the power, claiming the power to be of great benefit that's the education in the nature of mind. It's amazing. That's the Four Mainstays lifestyle. That's not the thing. It's the education in the nature of vast mind, wi wide open. Our mind is entirely, brilliantly, amazingly beneficial. Awesomely beneficial. Incredibly just beneficial. <laughs> it's amazing. And that's who we are. And stepping up into that power rather than disempowering into a closed system that is made up of data descriptions. So there you have the choice, the most important choice. And that choice you have in every moment, because every moment is just the moment we have, really. It's like one moment at a time, where, where is the other moment? Or Where's the next moment? But it's just like one moment at a time. Even if you think of the future, everything is just one moment at a time. And it's the opportunity to rely on open intelligence rather than emphasizing data. And it is this simplicity that, that the Four Mainstays lifestyle is. It just means, because we are, we are anyway, we are, we are living a lifestyle. If it's emphasizing data or recognizing the fundamental nature of everything and resetting our entire system to open intelligence where mind is completely clear already so so you don't have to do anything you know, like in every moment just seeing what is what would serve and what would be of most benefit and um, so we can't come with a script you know, I can't really prepare. I don't know who's here. What are the questions? And so this is the power of open intelligence. And it's amazing because everyone is so unique and so powerful, even though we are so united and so the same. You know, you hear when you hear something about desire and, you know, like just hearing these stories, we just exactly know what is meant. Like we see someone, we just want to run after that. that it's just like <laughs> we, we Commonly, the data streams just like that, desire, sex. When we hear these words, it, we, we share an experience of how we, what, what we do with all these thoughts and emotions and experiences, it's just what we learned. 
taking them to be something. Now to recognize that nothing has an independent nature and doesn't have power over us, that mind and data are clear, inseparably so, and we have the power to be entirely beneficial. It doesn't mean that you never ever have sex again. <laughs> so I wanted just to emphasize that. <laughs> because otherwise you might not come back and think, oh, that meeting over there, no more sex. <laughs> but what is really true about what you're observing here is that everyone is taking responsibility. Each person is taking responsibility for their data. Because very well, when you make this imagination, if you go with your data streams of desire, for example, it can be very messy because, <coughs> it, like, especially in Goa, like everyone looks attractive and, you know, it's just like that. And so when, when here, coming here, we have a, pro we, we, we come here to educate ourselves in the nature of mind and to get to know ourselves fully. And that means we are just seeing everything. We, we, we're seeing suddenly, wow, there's so many emotions and thoughts and experiences all day long. In the morning, you could be attracted to someone. In the evening, you think, wow, that's weird. <laughs> you know, it's quite a weird. <laughs> and so and then next day again, wow actually good and you know like it's like it's up and down and it and it's same thing in an intimate relationship you know somebody 10 years and you have the data stream in the morning and another one in the evening or maybe one second and the next second the other so it's just, it's like the mind is um, open intelligence has the wild and dynamic display of countless and ceaseless emotions thoughts and experiences data data we call to keep it simple, it's, it's a, a wild array, you just see it. And when you let everything be as it is, as open intelligence, recognizing open intelligence as inseparable from data, then the power of open intelligence is obvious. And that's one short moment at a time. And that's incredible. And the four mainstays, now we're talking about open intelligence, short moments as the first mainstay. Then a meeting like this, where we talk and hear and confirm open intelligence, the trainings is the second mainstay, where all you hear is open intelligence in various ways. But it, in a really, like we share our experience, that's what is happening. Share our experience of recognizing and relying on open intelligence and gaining assurance in, in the nature of mind, in daily life, like nothing needs to change. You just recognize open intelligence right there. And then all the trainings and the, you know, the media online, these, these videos, they evoke open intelligence. Hearing others speak about it evokes open intelligence. And it's not getting rid of anything. It's it's not like stirring the pond, you know, when you have lots of the pond and it stirs it up and then there are all these, these dirt particles. But if you let it rest be as it is, everything is clear. And these dirt particles, they are inseparable from open intelligence. <laughs> all the things we want to get rid of, they're inseparable like sky. And the trainings, they just evoke open intelligence and confirm. And then that's why we, we're offering all these trainings here, one-day trainings and 12-day trainings and anything that, yeah, anything to, to empower open intelligence and our amazing ability to be of benefit. And you see it already in your life. It's like that wish to be of benefit in whatever way it comes out and um, and then we go for it we definitely go for it but first we we gain assurance and it's 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 powerful to gain assurance in open intelligence and to really see who we are and get used to it basically it's like getting used to it and seeing other people, well, first, there's a, the, th the third um, mainstay is the trainer. So there are people that um, introduced to open intelligence 
who tested the four mainstays and then, you know, like, I just see the benefits. My whole life changed. I think, wow, I don't have to, I don't have to work on myself anymore. And seeing the power to be of benefit just right in myself. And then the fourth mainstay is the community. And then knowing this is true for everyone. That's amazing. You see other people who rely on open intelligence and, and recognize their power to be of great benefit. And then there are so amazing people. Everyone has unique strengths, gifts, and talents that just like, they just burst forth in open intelligence. Because then you don't limit yourself. You know that one, oh, I can't do it. Or I'm not good enough. These kinds of data streams, they just open up and used for the benefit of all. So that then suddenly you see you're completely okay. Like, wow, I so just saw, wow, everything about me is just okay. Even if I'm totally like, like totally lost in my thoughts and emotions of desire or anger, raging, or in the morning you wake up and you're so moody and you don't want to, you know, just don't want to get up. And test open intelligence, just in those moments, one moment at a time anyway. We have only one moment at a time. Then reset. Like this reset, just a picture, reset. Remember, reset, and then first, and then reset, open intelligence, open intelligence, immediate benefit. It's like all it's resounding in my mind at the moment. <laughs> you hear the reset, open intelligence. Mind is completely clear and, and entirely beneficial. And to know this about myself is just the greatest gift I, I can imagine in my life. So, you can, yeah, the four mainstays, yeah, they are not a thing and they are uh, an environment of empowerment. It's all you hear. And then seeing other people, it's just, it's, it's amazing seeing that, that openness. We're not, uh, not afraid anymore of what can come up. And no more struggle. Just imagine, like a person who has nothing more to do. You rest in your powers of great benefit. Yo, be the power. <laughs>